So there's a change coming in tomorrow's patch. As everyone knows, tomorrow's going to be the big balancing patch. And I want to discuss this because a lot of people seem to be a little bit confused or a little bit questioning why this is happening. There's going to be a change to Tap Dancer or I guess dodging as a whole in the game. And a lot of people are wondering why. So let's actually jump into the midst of everything. So the issue was, especially at the higher tier of gameplay, that... Tap Dancer was essentially like a mandatory talent. Like you'd be way worse off if you didn't have Tap Dancer defensively, right? And there are some things that would just, I mean, it wouldn't guarantee hit you, but you're a lot, 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 lot more likely to get hit by certain things if you didn't have Tap Dancer and it made it a lot more difficult, especially at the higher tier gameplay. So a lot of people saw it as a mandatory talent that you need to take, similar to other mandatory talents that exist in the game, um, which are there are very few of, but still, right? <clears throat> so they wanted to address this by basically changing it to where basically everybody essentially will have Tap Dancer, but not a strong version of it what's going to happen is that basically your base dodges will be similar to tap dancer but that second dodge you get after your first dodge gets canceled right will be uh, on a longer cooldown after you do that second roll right what tap dancer the talent will now do is just basically be what tap dancer currently is right now it will just be the same thing but like a shorter cooldown on the second roll right and that's basically the change you're doing now initially back then the proposed idea was just basically to remove the functionality of tap dancer forever from the game right or like you just wouldn't be able to do the double dodge thing unless you know the first you know dodge actually dodge something but um there was a lot of issues and uh, i guess the the way it was looked at is that this would be the cleanest method to basically balance everything to where everyone has tap dancer and it's a lot easier to balance things from there on forward and not just have like two different ways that the game can be played with or without tap dancer right so now it's just everyone has it right um and that's kind of the method they had going forward there so yeah i just want to cover that quick change it is going to be a pretty interesting change i'm very interested to see how it will change gameplay especially on the lower side and the higher side of pvp scale right but again um yeah they did this so it doesn't have to be such a mandatory talent there's gonna be a lot of other changes that i'm probably gonna discuss in a big video tomorrow going over everything because there is quite a few things um but yeah thanks for watching guys and uh, let me know what you guys think about this change see you guys later